during those times, I actually was a reporter, and crime was terrible during that time, right? Which is probably part of the reason that Bernie Sanders himself voted for that crime bill he's now complaining about. Well, the reason Bernie voted for that crime bill is because, like a lot of legislation, there were some very good things in it. Uh, the Violence Against Women Act, for example, uh, he supported. The assault weapon ban, he has, for his, the course of his entire career, been for banning assault weapons. It's the reason he lost his first race for Congress in Vermont, was his opposition to assault weapons and, sa and saying that they shouldn't be out on the streets. So, and, 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 and there were aspects of that bill that were very bad. And Bernie Sanders, at that time, went to the but floor still, of the United Sanders, States Congress and talked about it. But, but, but Bernie Sanders did vote for that bill, and he, he, yes. he voted I, for I, it in good conscience, I, w I, would, I would think, he, right? He, he certainly did, Carol. But like a lot of legislation, like I said, there were some very good things in it, and there were some very bad things in it. Now, what Bernie Sanders did and what the Clintons did not do, they did the exact opposite of this, is at the time, he said, listen, I support this legislation because there's a lot of good things in there that we need. But let me tell you what will happen if this legislation is implemented. And he pointed to all of the problems, including mass incarceration, that stemmed from that legislation. But he, he also still stated, voted for it. He did vote and for it. And couldn't you say and, that about any bill that has a lot of stuff in it that, that maybe not everyone, isn't that compromise? Well, Isn't it, it, that sure. unifying? Listen, when Bernie Sanders was the chairman of the Veterans Committee in the Senate, he led into law, along with John McCain and the Republicans in the House, a fundamental reform of the Veterans Administration and added more resources for veterans' health care than we've seen in a generation. Now, he was not 100% happy with that bill. He wanted to do a lot more and he wanted to do it differently. But he understands the way the legislative process worked. That's why he worked with Senator McCain and others and found unanimous, practically, support for that bill. The legislative process is messy at times. Bernie Sanders, 25 years serving in the Congress has taught him that sometimes you have to make compromise. And that's why, for example, he passed more amendments on but, roll but call could, votes than any member that, of Congress. But the Clintons also had to compromise to, to get a crime bill passed to, to bring down the terrible crime levels that existed in the 1990s. I would say certainly they had to compromise, but they didn't have to exploit these issues, which they did for their political advantage by using terms like super predators by saying that we need to bring them to heel, talking about young African-American kids, okay? They didn't have to do that, but they chose to do it to gain political advantage. I think that this is well documented, and I think Senator Sanders is absolutely correct to point this out now. All right, Tad Devine, thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate it.